What's your, like, how could you and Flacco be friends? We got to start off, like, let's try to, like. Can we start there? Like, how, how can we be friends? Well, we already bigged him up, though, so we can't forget that yeah. when we did the Collapse of No Jumper video, we bigged him up about where we thought his strengths were. Yeah. But we also highlighted where his weaknesses were. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. <laughs> Nobody's a breath critique. Yeah, exactly. So, if he stays in, if he plays his position and gets better in those, um. In those areas that we said he can get better in, mm -hmm. sure we could be friends. So I this see, nigga just got to be better. He got to be better, yeah. but I could. But honestly, it's no too, quarrel. It's, it's no quarrel. It's no, but no. I just i I don't understand what he got mad about. Unless he got mad because he likes that. You know what I mean? Like he. Yeah, he's well. He's he's definitely one to. Uh, he does like uh, confrontation and going at people yeah. like he he's Word. a he's a fan of going to war on youtube like mm -hmm. oh. that was one of the things he built his his youtube off of he was part of the dr umar johnson community that would like go to war against dr umar johnson haters hmm. pretty right. much this he is, was a defendant of the prince of pan africanism exactly yeah that was like his first youtube story arc yeah this nigga was a part of the dr umar militia nigga. he was a part yeah, of the literally. diaspora yeah literally like, literally yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like heavy Israelite knees yeah. and all so heavy that was, Israelite that was his thing that was his so him going to war he would and in his words exactly uh -huh. you know we would violate somebody for 500 views that was like that was his mindset that was his mindset yeah. essentially you know what I'm saying mm -hmm. I mean 500 um, views you know 500 views are a lot I yeah. mean I, I'm still not turning 500 views down you know what and I'm wait, especially so that, for some niggas like us so that was his mindset and do you have what he said to us yeah, like in the comments, yo, bro, that's what I was, was about like, to pull up. I was about to read him, nigga. At three oh four. Because if that was, if that he was doing that for five hundred, and then views. just for some context as mm -hmm. well too, that video that he commented on was no jumper fans are desperate to fill the void. It was an episode from the, it was a clip from the Three Oak podcast mm -hmm. where I was talking to Shane uh -huh. about like how since no jumper content is trash right now, you know. the fans are looking for a void to fill in seeking comment content. Mm -hmm. Then I told Shane. Flocka was even in our comments, and I don't know why. He must not have heard when I was talking hella shit about him. Mm -hmm. And then that's when the comments started. And if you would like to consume that, I'm sure the YouTube algorithm yeah, got that little, shit right yeah, below. I'll put the little thing in the somewhere. But this nigga Poetic Flocka proceeded to type at 304. Nah, I seen it. Laugh out loud. <laughs> but hurry is not of the devil. Hurry is the devil. Mm -hmm. Don't let the weakness in you affect the greatness in you. Hayden. Lying, burning bridges for microwavable views isn't too smart of you. Why rush war? Only the dead have seen the end of war. I'll eventually give you the YouTube smoke you're looking for. But for now, I'll support the content any way I can. Seeing black men eat is much more seeing black men eat is much more enjoyable than slandering and hating for views. He So this nigga he j he, so he, he went sudden, to rehab he, on his mind. This, this is the first time in history Wait. we've seen the flock on the poetic part. Mm -hmm. Take take effect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is how, we ain't seen the Flacco side either. Nigga, his knees are huge. This you know, how, Flacco yeah. is skinny and spanky. Yeah, but that's so, the yeah. thing. He said a lot of nothing. Like, did. what did he even he did. say? He dropped like, a lot did of you quote, just say there's that? A, 50, 70 per, 50 percent of me or seventy percent of me don't even think he wrote it. So literally, yeah, that's a little Sun Tzu. Unless, that's a little Robert Green in there. Yeah, it, yeah. Unless it's what we thought. Like he loves the hate, but he hates the love. It's right, just, it's right, just right. But it does show that he's well read. I'm not going to diss a nigga for being able to, you know. To, to be able to take if, a poetic quote and he, use it if, in a just situation. If he yeah, did especially it. in a YouTube you comment. You feel me? Like in a if YouTube comment? Yeah. Now, this comment was deleted, too. Mm -hmm. This comment did get deleted within moments of it, within like a couple minutes of him posting it. Why do you think that was? I think it's because he realized he gave a small channel way too much. Yeah. yeah. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's what it comes we down to. We making another video about it's it. Like, yeah, it's, it's, exactly. We opened up with your knees, nigga. Yeah. That <laughs> you was you. Yeah. You gave us the I attention was we was looking for. You know what I'm <laughs> we over here trying to violate a nigga for 50 views. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right, right. <laughs> so I think that was the main reason why he got rid of it. Uh, like, he was like, what am I... Like, he thought to himself... Which that part was smart. Mm -hmm. Why am I giving this much smoke mm -hmm. to a channel with eighteen hundred subscribers? What am I doing right now? He uh, remembered the Michelle Obama quote: "When they go low, we go high." Yeah, you need to brace that comment. But you know, I take the Charlemagne the God approach: when yeah. they go low, we take it to the flow. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, like, shit! Oh my God! <laughs> hey, that's, and that's what we did. Nigga, I mean, we yeah, take yeah. it to the fortified basement. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> so because yeah. so because his comment was just like so many quotes and things slapped together. I just put. <laughs> I hope when the day I hope when the day comes I hope you're as poetic in the video response that you are on this keyboard. 
because Man. I wasn't about to type no paragraph because mm-hmm. I knew we were going to come here and we are going to be able to mm-hmm. do our thing because this is a few things. Just to lightly respond, the smoke that I'm looking for, I'm never looking for smoke, but I'm damn sure not running from nothing either. I'm AJ Domenos for a reason. You come this way if you want to. Mm-hmm. Like, let's just put that out there. Mm-hmm. So, uh, so that's number one. Number two... Something about microwavable views. Uh, what did he say? Slander and hate for microwavable views. We're doing objective criticism. Now, yeah. if you want to take the criticism as hate, that's fine, because I'm a hater, too. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I have no problem. Mm-hmm. I'll step away from the constructive criticism. I'll just straight hate on a nigga for 30 minutes if mm-hmm. I feel like it. You know? Straight salt. <laughs> just straight salt. Make him choke Straight on. chip on the shoulder. <laughs> I have no problem doing that either. Hating is fun. I don't know. Area, uh, there's, you know, mm-hmm. So I have no problem doing that either. But... Throw the joke up, somebody. But it's also yeah. like it's it was a premise to everything we were saying. It's not like right. we was just hating because yeah, what, it's not like we just came out of the blue. You know what it I mean? was like, let me tell you about this nigga. I can't stand. Yeah, you know yeah. What I'm saying? It was like, a lot of. I yeah. mean, I it was in do, it was in context. It was in good taste. I think it might have been a few jokes that he not fucking with, but yeah, you know, right. We gotta have a better sense of humor. You know? Microwavable views. That part is always funny because that's you trying to take an ethical stance on things. Mm-hmm. What your content and your channel has built on, you're never allowed to take that stance. Nigga, he interviewed Ever. a bitch and asked her about a BBL. That's right. What I mean. And I'm and not saying we're above those type of questions. Right. But, but not, not even outside of that, his content after he transitioned out of the Umar world mm-hmm. was a lot of, that's when he started like emulating the DJ Academic stuff. It's like stuff. a bootleg DJ Academic. A bootleg DJ yeah. Academic. A watered down. Yeah, a watered down. That's a better way to you say it. You know what I mean? A, a watered mm-hmm. down version of Academics. Yeah. But only the Warren Chirac academics. So it's not the new academics. You water down the worst parts of DJ, of DJ academics mm-hmm. and built your channel off the backs of hood black pain. You know what I'm saying? Like literally, like uh, shootings, killing all the nigga shit that happens in disenfranchised neighborhoods. That's what your channel thrived off of mm. and still does. Like let's not act like because it, so it's always funny when like Flacco tries to take this. Uh, Grandstand. He tries to take this ethical content like approach. High ground type yeah, there's more high ground ethical content stance when you can never do that. Like one of your biggest videos was about uh, some sort of murder or some just some good we, shit. We just proved that he wrote this. He because he's a terrible uh, debater. Right. You know what I mean. He yeah. can't formulate well, the like, fucking arguments. You know what I mean. He can't even speak the argument. Even you feel if he me? had a great hold argument. Hold on, hold on. In regards to this, in terms of this right here. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, but that's, that's the pause. Out, that's, the pause. <laughs> that's the pause. That's that the pause that you get. Yeah, you yeah, yeah. 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 Was, but shout out to she, Flacco for be somehow <laughs> being less articulate than us and making it further than us. Yeah, right, right, right. Once again, I mean, this is an episode where we talk shit about niggas who don't give a fuck about us. Well, that, you know? no. To be fair, I remember him talking about his come up, and his grind was ten videos a day. Every mm. single day. You got to respect the work ethic. He's so, putting the weed yeah, in the yeah. bag. There's certain things I'm always going to respect the work ethic. Mm. And now that we figured out where our lane is, especially to get these views, if we drop 10 a day, nigga, we'd be mm. in trouble. Like, mm. we would, we'd be there in three months type shit. You know what I'm saying? And like, I respect yeah. anybody with the confidence to walk out in open-toed shoes with no socks just all the time. Like toes. that. You, you know feel I mean? me? I got yeah. basketball. LA, I got basketball feet. I can't do that. Yeah. yeah. I'd be a... Public minutes if I had my toes up right now. Yeah, I would. Yeah, it's I, not that bad, but you know, it would be. Yeah, I respect anybody who coming outside with fat around their knees. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah. yeah the same shorts that I'm wearing. You like, know what's what interesting? Doing? I've never seen him walk. You ever seen him like stand and move around? Saw him run. Saw him I run. saw him run. You saw him. He, he, raced, he raced Gina views. Yeah, he wanted. To, yeah, he kind of. He's fast for a bigger dude. Yeah. Can we pull this up? He's built like a fucking football player. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Like <laughs> he got a nice thirty yeah. forty yard dash. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But then he when does. he walks, he does the whole. He does the waddle. He does the. You know the yeah. auntie on yeah. the Zion yeah. like type. The Zion. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know he does one of those. Like his back doesn't move separately. Yo, shout out poetic Flacco, man. I can he's... literally hear. I can hear Gina's voice in that clip. What power was you feeling in your vein when you said that? I remember when she said that <laughs> shit. That's just funny. Shout out to Gina. Yo, he's moving. Yeah, he's moving. Got good form and everything. <laughs> 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 oh, my God. It's probably form. from the ricochet of this nigga thumping the ground. Yo, this nigga has good form. Yeah, good that's form. What, like, and he wasn't trying. He, he wasn't okay, trying. shout out yeah. Flacco for being the most graceful Yo. runner with the biggest legs. He Nick. calls it, he calls himself the most athletic person in, in the office. Now that is a reason. There's room for that. <laughs> yeah. I wonder what his squad is. Nigga, it's 
Adams mm, a That'd be food. interesting. He he the type that might squat 500. Like 500, 15. You know what I'm saying? Just, after eating two hot packets. Right, 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 right. Yo, would you, if you had to box this nigga in a public boxing match. I could race this nigga and I'd fuck him up in that race. How are you going to pick him apart? Uh, it wouldn't take, I mean, it wouldn't take long. <laughs> Is that like it an would, obvious answer for you? Yeah, it wouldn't, <laughs> oh, yeah, I know, I mean, uh, yeah, it wouldn't take long. I got, I'm taller than him. I know I am. Yeah. And so I'm sure my reach is longer than him. And it's like the endurance. I'm sure I'll be him endurance too. So it just it would stamina. I mean, I, I would draw, explosiveness. I would pull a Floyd. You know what I'm saying? How many rounds do you need this to go so that we can get the most money? I out like of it? this. You know what I'm saying? I like, like that this is playing on the loop because I'm trying to figure out how Gina failed. They saying that. But he's his, stomping the ground his, too hard. They said his body was gro- going into her, and she might have thought he was about to. And he's nah, an immovable. Into her, and she. That's what happens. When is he you, running barefoot? He's nah. Definitely, of course he's running barefoot. He's African. That's what happens when you haven't ran in like a minute. Yeah, when your your your, your motor skills ain't up, bro. Yeah. All it takes is a toe slipping. Yeah, right, and like, everything will go down, especially mm-hmm. a pinky toe. <laughs> right. Yeah, like she does, she looks like she's not using efficient body mechanics. Like, like she's working she's, harder than when she's running. Like her, yeah, she looks so heavy. Did right? she pop a tip? Probably. Gina, Gina trying to get some views. G- right. <laughs> shout Gina, shout Gina's, Gina, Gina's titties man. used to like that was one thing about Gina. It's like. She know how to dress to where you always wonder if if, if a nipple was gonna pop out. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Okay. Always like <laughs> like I don't know how she used to keep them in, but goddamn it, every time I would see her in certain yeah. outfits, God, I'm like, y- why are you sexualizing? She's a journalist, nigga. She Stop is, sexualizing. But right. She knows what she's doing too at the same time. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Look at the shirt she's wearing. But, the shirt uh, she's wearing is forcing her tits to go left and right. That she. How wants. are they not popping out of this? You yeah. see what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, her whole chest is uh, the the shirt is split down to her navel. She's got good rotation on her upper body. Yo, the way the hey. fitted fell. Look at the fitted. That shit just <laughs> fell. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> Look at it. Boop, boop. <laughs> it's like that's that's the sad part. Her and her hat collapsed, nigga. nigga. Fuck the fuck her. Yeah, and fumble the those fitted. Who, uh, y'all have seen this poetic? This is the we're why, on loop. We're watching the poetic flock over <laughs> Gina race. Yeah, we should just keep this on for the remainder of the episode. Until we need the monitor. <laughs> But, and anytime I'm feeling sad, let me just look. But then hey. this is Gina taking an L. I don't want to see Gina taking an L. It's a lovely day to hit the gravel. But um, but man, shout to, out, shout out to Flacco, man. Just to close out the Flacco, from whenever the day comes, I, I yeah. don't, I don't care when the day comes. Hey, but before just, you, before you say that, to play devil's advocate on his point real quick, right? He is right to where you don't want to coming out the gate when you a newborn in this shit, or you just don't have as much notoriety. You don't want to necessarily burn the bridges with the niggas that's big and powerful. True. Not saying we got to suck them off or nothing, right. but it's yeah. like Flacco could have been a fan. I think he still is. I uh, think he's a fan because of what we said. I think this is right. all a joke. I don't think Yeah, I don't like, think it's Flacco's, that. I don't think it's that. I don't think you think he's like, trolling? I think, yes. And, and Flacco that's why- has, Flacco has come to our channel over the last three weeks. He's a fan. That's why when he said, yeah. I'm going to wait on y'all, basically, I'm going to meet y'all at the top. I know you're going right, to- gonna, gonna, I know I'm going to see, gonna you, see you, you again. I like that optimism. You know what I, I mean? That's, what, I know that's, that's good enthusiasm right there. Man. <laughs> yeah. Manifestation and powerful thing. Because yeah. it, this is Flacco we're talking about. This is like- Like- It's like- That's Flacco. a good Imagine, spin. I thought ima- I was spinning. Like Tupac- <laughs> like three six, Y'all niggas don't know, he used to be 360 Noble. <laughs> That was his first hood moniker back in the day. <laughs> I could do a spinning room. Not a <laughs> wave in his head. <laughs> but nah, man, I think this is why I fuck with Flacco. Like, I feel like we can say whatever we want about him. Yeah, and like, he we, t- yeah. like, he's just, I mean, it's Flacco. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Flacco. And it's, who and are we talking about? There's still no hate, and it's not like whatever like that. And I don't feel like there will be a bridge that he has that I'll be... I'm dying to cross anyway. And you know what I'm saying? And even with the Adam 22 thing. There's not a single thing. Look, at if he was like, come on, no jumper, and like give us your critique on here about what's been going on. No. Nah. You wanna do it? No. Nah. I don't think I would do it. I, I don't think I'd do it not anymore. Before mm-hmm. all this happened, I would have, mm-hmm. but not no more. Just too because, much smut over there in that studio. Yeah, it's too much smut. It, but on top of that, it's like I don't think it's necessary. I, yeah. I just don't think it's necessary. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Like uh-huh. even if <laughs> I mean if we haven't had a full podcast crack 10K, I know we would crack 10 You know what I'm saying? Even though things like that would happen, I'm not thirsty for that. I know mm-hmm. how to reach that market now Yeah. from the same from the YouTube account that's got 1,800 mm-hmm. followers. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not dying to sit in a and building just to have a conversation with somebody on a platform. Just because of who they are and what they've done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not pressed on that. And at the same time, anytime I'm talking about somebody, I make sure I separate 
the business or the, what they're actually doing to the person. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm, yeah. So yeah, each of them might get smoked, but the I could still be looking at you positively on the business side. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I just don't. I might not like the moves you're making and the things you're doing. But for the Flacco thing, if it ever does come to it, it's not that big of a deal. I'm with it because. I'm with the bullshit just like you with the bullshit. I, you know what I'm saying? We not, can run barefoot I'm not too. As, I'm not as motivated, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, just never forget, you did say this. Yo, this week, like, you became my top three favorite white boy of all time, right? Because, again, before this week, I, I'll be real. Trump, Jesus, and Adam-22 probably had you beat. Who's he talking I'll about? say this. Trap Yeah, right? <laughs> That's as good as it gets. No, right? Listen, and you probably took Trump out of my top three. I mean, no, 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 no. Nah, I, I'm capping. Trump can't be out of my top three. Maybe you took Adam out of my top three, man. Uh, don't, don't do Adam like that, bro. <laughs> I don't like the way his jokes are landing. He, They're not landing well. Wait, he's, he has a... A tier, a top tier he white tier, man. He has a hierarchy yes, of white he, boys. He does. And Trump is at the top. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah. And we will never be the same. That's why I'm not really worried about anything. You know what I'm okay. saying? <laughs> you know well, what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> That's, is, this is crazy. Is Trump the worst person? Is he the worst person? I think... I think no, uh, no, I don't think he's the worst what's person. What's that nigga's name? This nigga's far worse. What's that nigga he what used he to do? have... Uh, you are the father, Maury. I mother. think he's done... More worse, you know, more bad for the black community than nah. Trump ever did. Nah, I don't think so. Nah. 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 Nope. I don't think so. Maury didn't tell that bitch to fuck all them niggas and get confused on who right. the daddy was. Yeah. But he he put it on a platform for Maury it to be. If even. anything, Maury's Broadcast helping them. He's, he's, Maury he's, he's didn't solving even, drama. Yeah, and Maury no. didn't even. Uh, it wasn't nearly as bad. Nah, I can't. Nah, I can't nowhere even, close. I don't think so, nigga. Mm. Mm. It was all good. But huh? yeah, it was all but, good fun and humor. Them niggas was having a good time for Flacco. But I do appreciate Flacco coming to our channel. Giving us support. Mm. Um, I wonder how he found us. From one African American to an African. I do appreciate that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. From a North Carolinian to a North different. Dakotian. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't got no problem. I don't got no problem with the nigga. I just don't like his indecisiveness. Like, do you fuck with us or do you not? You know what I'm saying? Maybe like, he's still on the fence. Maybe he on the He might be on the fence. Maybe you know? this video will convince him. Hey. Yeah, like that one nigga who called us gay and then he donated $21, $20. $20. Yeah. Shout out to you. He's the, he's the one. Yeah, yeah. The evolution of yeah, the yeah, supporter. Shout out to you. Well, what I, yeah, because I was going to print the comments out, the evolution of him. Mm. And then just frame that twenty, mm. bro, and just put it on the wall too. Yeah. That that deserves to be framed. Do you know yeah. what I'm saying? It's yeah. beautiful. <laughs> and, it's and an amazing. Feat. When there's like a, a first like national show, he deserves to get the free for slot, sure. the free ticket. For the free, you know what I'm saying? He deserves yeah. all that mm -hmm. shit for sure. Yeah. Let me make sure I get his name right too. Shout yeah. yo, shout to that good brother. I, I hope. Where's my screenshot? Who do you think he is? You think he's white? I don't know. Who you think gay. a nigga? Dude, I mean, a, I don't know. I don't tip. Bro, the nigga is probably. Uh, his name Indian. is I am Andre Johnson two oh nine. He's definitely Andre black. Johnson. Oh, he's yeah, he's, he's definitely black. Yeah. Nigga, Andre. he's AJ too. Yeah, shout yeah. out to Andre Johnson. Yeah, yeah it's another AJ black. for sure. Mm. Um, so yeah, so, I mean, since we're in the um poetic flock on no jumper world, let's just stay there and just get to the continuation of uh 